Okay, so they're like, either they're getting drugged the fuck up, or they're totally getting like, like they're in a fucking PC or something. They're in a like fucking PC Macintosh. Oh, we actually got like an intro too. You getting names? Yeah. Oh, oh god. Write all these down <laughs> quick. Sonia Nevermind. What? <laughs> Is that really a last name? Kane Awari. Uh, what? <laughs> I can't read that. <laughs> Who are these people? I, I swear I saw Gundam and Soda. These can't be names. And, oh, cool. I guess the fucking friendly rabbit is actually going to be evil. There's so much. Okay, welcome to Dongan Island. <laughs> okay. It's so hard to keep up with any of this. I'm not catching any of their names. Are you having any luck? I have no. <laughs> oh, God. Pekoyama. Pekoyama. Upside down. Yeah, I know. It's like, I guess we'll get the names anyways, but I feel like. For an intro, this is hard to keep up with. Togami Byakuya. What? He should be... He... Okay, so Togami Byakuya's in the first game. And he's not fat. He's not that guy. <laughs> he's like this rail-thin, like, douchebag. Uh, okay, we should save our pro... We've made a lot of progress here. Do you think we should save in every empty save slot? Do you think it'll matter? No. Okay. I never do that. Okay. Okay. Uh, hey, hey, oh, can you hear? Oh, wait, this is probably, yeah, there he is. Uh, are you okay? You seem pretty out of it. We also, we went over this already. Fucking wake up. Get the fuck up. Slap your ass. Are you sure you're okay? Leave me alone, you uh, know? <laughs> Alright, man, a little bitch. No way I can leave someone alone when they look that pale. You know, whitey. I <laughs> <Not> sandy bitch. <laughs> Crystal blue ocean. The sun's rays beaming down on me. That bird just somehow <laughs> flying. <laughs> that bird is like paper. <laughs> this soft tropical wind brushing my skin. Brushing. I definitely don't know what's going on. I was supposed to attend Hope Speak Academy. Why did this? Why am I here in a place like this? That rapid thing said we're on a tropical island. Yeah, that don't get it. Yeah, you right. <laughs> <laughs> I have no idea what's going on. That's the only thing I can say with absolute certainty. Uh, welcome to Dangan Island. I will explain the basic controls to you. It is me tutorial. With the left stick, you can man maneuver the reticle on the screen. If the reticle responds, press the A button. You can then examine the person or object. Also, you can shift your point of view with the right stick. If you press the... Uh, what? What? What button is that? I'm on an Xbox controller. <laughs> you can use a mysterious power to see everything you can examine. The world sure has become super convenient if you're able to do this all from the get-go. Now, please, search for the beach thoroughly and progress the story. Uh... Oh, it's it's Y. It's the Y button. Okay. Ooh. Okay, so what, what, what should we what should look should we look at anything really? You think it'll be think it'll be uh, worth it? I was always looking at that camera thing. This one? Yeah. All right, what's going on over here? Hmm, is that a camera? Uh, yeah. A surveillance camera. It's Not, just a camera. Yeah, it's one Are of those. Monitored or something? Yeah, it's for like all those fucking. It's like secret porno, except it's not a secret at all. Yeah, I wouldn't say we're being monitored. I just think we're being watched for our safety. Oh, it's a weird time to think about. Best not to worry. Look at that TV. <laughs> oh, what's with this guy? How could he be so calm in a situation like this? Maybe he's just a chill guy. Yeah, you right. All right, let's take a look. What's going on with this TV? Hello? Why is there a monitor in a place like this? The screen is blank. What is this being used for? I mean... What is it? <laughs> what does it mean? Okay. Uh, there's either the ocean, there's a tree... What's up? Talk to the guy. Maybe yeah. he can get his name. Yeah, he'll probably... Oh, we fucking knocked him over. Oh, it... Okay, I guess it wants us to... Okay, what's going on with this tree? Is it somehow special? I guess it makes sense for there to be palm trees on a tropical island. That's a mighty fine palm <laughs> tree, but now that's not the time for me to be impressed by it. Mighty fine. That was... Okay. I... Okay. It's, I guess, like, if this is, it's tutorial, it's important, whatever. The crystal clear, shining blue sea, it's perfect for a tropical island. Just what's going on here? I never wanted anything like this at all. Dude, how could you be upset that you get, like, a free vacation to a tropical island? So how you feel? You calm down now? 
I understand your confusion about everything that's happened, but why don't we start with an introduction? Introduction? I'm N-Bomb Komaida. Nice to meet you. Whoa, Komaida. The ultimate lucky... lucky Who's the ultimate lucky student in the... Okay, whatever. I generally know what these characters are about, but I... I don't know. A lot of it's still kind of... Uh, uh, along with my introduction, I guess I'll also tell you about my talent, so you know why Hope Peak Academy chose me. Well, even if I tell you in my case, it's a pretty disappointing talent. Jason? A you... disappointing talent? What do you mean? I'm lucky. What are you talking about? What are you talking about? <laughs> it's not a joke or anything. That's my actual talent. I got nothing else going for me. I'm, I'm just the ultimate lucky student. At least what I, that's what I'm called anyways. Ultimate lucky student. Through Countrywide Lottery, apparently only one ordinary student selected at random to attend. Hope Speak Academy is the ultimate lucky student. Except for in the first game, there's already another one like that, so I don't really know what's going on. And that lucky winner just so happened to be me. Chosen by a lottery, is that really okay? You, yeah, you'd really think they wouldn't want to do that for their fucking academy for, like, the ultimates. What if it was, like, a random person that won? Yeah, like, just some random dude. I guess we're just trying to say, like, whoever wins is the ultimate lucky student, but, like... Or it's unlucky. Yeah, because they're just going to murder. Is that even a real talent in the first place? Yo, what you say about my fucking talent? How strange. All right, them fighting words. Your face looks troubled. Oh, no, it's not trouble or anything. No, no, it's fine. I got mixed feelings about this, too. Yeah, whatever. You call my talent bullshit. What, what do you even do? What's your skill? I never thought an average, talentless high school student like me would ever enter Hope Speak Academy. At first, I declined, told them I didn't deserve it. They told me they really want me to attend. Apparently, the so-called luck of mine is a talent that even the school doesn't fully understand. To research it, the school picks the ultimate lucky student every year through an annual lottery. Okay, so I guess that's why there's another one. Hope's Peak Academy is amazing if they can actually research something as vague as luck. Well, thanks to that luck, a guy like me was able to attend Hope's Peak Academy, so for that, I'm grateful. But on the other hand, I feel a little out of place here. Uh, sorry, I have a bad habit of viewing things <laughs> through a pessimistic lens. I was just thinking about what if I'd given him the Uncle Ruckus voice instead. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> uh, yeah, I guess that's it for my introduction. Hmm? Nagito Ko. And what? What would he, what did he say his name was? Uh, Komaida, I think? Komaida, huh? <laughs> he doesn't seem like the most reliable guy. But he doesn't strike me as a bad person either. He's just pessimistic. Yeah, like, I mean, even then, he's like... Okay, maybe, yeah, reliable would be a stretch. He's to talk to us. Yeah, he's like, he's pretty nice. I like him. Now that it's your turn, what do you do? Yeah, I'm Hajime Hinata. Then let me ask you a question. What's your ultimate talent? Um... I... Who... <laughs> it's... It's scatting. I'm the ultimate scat man. <laughs> I open my mouth, but the words will not form. Oh no. I my thoughts stalling in my head. They stole his scat. Which I guess also means his shit, but in this case, his ability to scat. As if I opened a book expecting to find words and instead found blank pages. It was that kind of uncomfortable feeling. The memory I was trying to recall had completely vanished from my mind. Uh-uh. <laughs> <laughs> I'm it. My body began to shudder as waves of discomfort began pounding against me. Pounding up uh, against me. Inside harder me. harder and harder. Pushing <laughs> me against the wall. <laughs> Hi, Jimmy. What's up? What happened? You look like you're having some gay thoughts. That's nothing. Don't worry about it. <laughs> I'm still pretty confused about all this. I'm having trouble remembering some things. Oh shit! I guess that means you're lower on the totem pole than me. Looks like you're the one that's gonna get spit roasted. I understand how your memory might be confused after suddenly getting into a situation like this. I'm sure you'll remember soon once you settle down. So I don't think you need to worry about it all that much, except for the spit roast. <laughs> I don't want to say you're right. <laughs> you're right. <laughs> Then I guess we're done with our introductions for now. Even though I don't understand what's going on, I hope we can get along. Obtained one hope fragment. Did something just beep? What a weird sound. I hastily stuck my hand to my pocket. Reached for something. <laughs> that strange mechanical sound just now definitely came from the inside of my pocket. <laughs> Ooh, what the hell is this? <laughs> it's like a PDA a smartphone. Why is something like this inside my pocket? Well, it's for modern day. We saw me just pass him out earlier, remember? Alright, you seem pretty out of it when that's going on. 
Now that you mention it, I think I kind of remember, but what is this? Uh, it's a fucking smartphone. It, it's an e-handbook, you little shit. I'm gonna poke you with this stick. What the? Where'd you come from? Get away from me with that stick. <laughs> oh, I startle you. I'm terribly sorry. Bah! <laughs> fucking smacks him on the head. <laughs> I know how to apologize like a good girl. Mmm, <laughs> good girl. Anyway, don't you think it's cool? That handbook is absolutely vital for the school trip, so make sure you don't lose it. This device is that important. I've asked everyone to use their e-handbook to gather all of the hope fragments. Hope fragments? Yeah, it's just some bullshit I made up. You'll obtain hope fragments as you get along with your classmates. As your relationship with everyone improves, you'll be able to gather more and more hope fragments. Gather hope fragments so that the flower of hope achieves its full bloom. Truly, that is the main purpose of this school trip. Love, love. Bye. Hey, where are you going? I disappeared into the sand. It's quicksand. Help me. <laughs> I'm dying. A stuffed animal that moves, talks, and also appears wherever and whenever she wants. Ah, help me. <laughs> Regardless of who's actually controlling it, it still doesn't make any sense. I feel pain like anyone else. And what was that all about? Hope fragments. Uh... What's your deal? It's like we're in a game or something. Uh, it feels like a game. That's rather comforting. That means we aren't going to be danger right away. He just fucking stomps the rest of her head into the sand. You're probably right, but... More importantly, you don't know anything about the other students yet, right? I think it's best if you at least introduce yourself to them. That's also true, but... Where did everyone go? Oh, fuck if I know. They Maybe they're... <laughs> they're, like, all behind you. They watch this entire thing. Maybe they're exploring the island as well. Exploring the island? Yeah, and their sexual side. As long as we're expected to live on this island, we should learn about that the, 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 we can about it. I had a stroke. For example, what's this island's name? Is there a way to escape? What about food and living arrangements? So, so why don't we finish introducing ourselves to the others and explore the island at the same time? I pretty much went around and introduced myself to everyone already, but I'll still tag along with you. So now it's decided to come with me, this little bitch. what you say? <laughs> It's in my head. <laughs> that's how simple for me. I know I'd worry if I was left on my own. Shall we get going then? <laughs> <laughs> Alright. But is this really okay? Nah. To feel so relaxed in such a strange situation? Perhaps it's the tropical climate. Oh, I got the vapors. Or is it that, what's her name, Usami's fault? What is that, Let's get going. Right, got it. Put a move on, beat them cheeks! <laughs> anyway, this is a nightmare, I have no idea if it's even started yet. My beats, my cheeks are beaten. I'm gonna slap that ass. Sheesh, what kind of nightmare is this? <laughs> you are now able to use the handbook. You can use it to check various information throughout the game. You can open the e handbook with the X button. Now it tells me the button. Uh, it's super easy. It's include the guidelines of the school trip and the report card, which documents everybody's information. There are various features inside the handbook. You can also save, load your game inside the handbook. Please check out system page as well. But wait, there's more. You can transcript the back button. That's all there is about the handbook. I don't know who I am, but I am aware enough to say I strongly recommend you play around with it yourself. Now then, go please go forth and look for everyone else. All right, you exit the beach with the B button. Okay, yeah, let's get going. We'll leave here. Uh, about exploring the island. It appears a map of this island has been installed on this e-handbook. If you use this, you should be able to find everyone easily. To be honest, before I arrived at this school, I did some research about everyone on the internet. I haven't learned everything about everyone, but I'm pretty sure I can give you some helpful info. Wait, you can research stuff like that on the internet? Oh yeah, like, Facebook, they give you all sorts of information that you, you should, like, not just give out to people. Hey, you don't know? This school is so popular, there are message boards online dedicated to talk about its students. Then was I also. No, absolutely not. You're not, you worth jack shit. I don't recall seeing your name there. Probably overlooked it. Oh, well, it's not your fault if you can't really remember. I'm sure my name was mentioned on there. <laughs> it's not a mistake. I was accepted into Hope's Peak Academy. <laughs> He's just like, I swear I'm on there. I swear. Look at it closer. Anyways, I hope out too. So, don't, don't make yourself look too pathetic. Why don't we begin making your introductions? Uh, 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 okay. You're right. <laughs> so first I need to introduce myself to everyone else on this island then. Uh, 
Oh, I should apologize. There was something I forgot to tell you. I, you thought you were out tutorial? No, fuck you. If you look at the map in your e-handbook, you'll be able to see where everyone is. You can also instantly travel to any location displayed as goal. Also, when you travel to point with it, <laughs> mark your tutorial progress. <laughs> it's super convenient, and let's go. Uh, oh my god, jeez. <laughs> it went like fucking blood red. I was scared. Travel on the island can be done through this screen. You can move with left stick. You can run by holding the B button while you move. If you press left and right direction button, you can also instantly move to the next area. Yeah. <laughs> When the reticular spawns, you could go inside places by pressing the A button. You probably realized it by now, but you happen to have your very own pet inside your e-handbook. Your pet grows on the number of steps you take, so try watching places using map jump. Wait, we have... Okay, when you finish raising pet, there may be small reward. Okay. Oh. 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 <laughs> this looks weird. <laughs> I don't know how I feel about this. Okay. <laughs> Wait. Uh, okay. Let's see. Who do we want to go looking for? Uh, oh, God. Yeah. Um, do you have a character you want to find? Let's just go in order. Okay, yeah. Oh, God. It looks like everybody's in there. Okay, but we're right there, so let's... Um... I honestly don't care too much about raising the pet, but also... Can I go up from here? What the hell? Wait, I'm confused by this map. I'm very easily confused. Going up, yeah. Uh, so if I keep going right, is it just going? Hold on, let me confirm with the map. I'm very, very dumb. No, oh no, I haven't even, I haven't even like moved yet. Wait, no, is that me? It says go. So, uh, oh, okay. I guess I should go up from here. Maybe that'll do it. Hajime, it looks like we can go across this bridge. We can at least reach another island not far from here. Is it safe? Oh, God, no. That's what we're going there to find out, right? It's not safe when we get there, then. What will you do? I don't know. I'm the ultimate lucky student. You'll probably die, but I'll be fine. Mm -hmm. Central Island. Uh, oh, God. Okay. It's <laughs> The other games don't have this perspective, so this one really weirds me out. Oh, no, he's like a titan. He's going <laughs> attack on titan mode. Aaron Yeager! <laughs> Jesus Christ. He's so thin. His legs are like little twigs. And Oh, oh, wait, why do I got... Oh, I had like a little notification, but I didn't know how to activate it. Was it... Uh, yeah, oh yeah, here it is. Oh, it is the pet. Um, chibi me. Um, clean. Presents. I got nothing for this. There's a lot of presents you can get. It's like a Pokédex. I'm saying Chibi Me's probably fine. Uh, whoop, whoop, wrong button. You know what? Uh, wait, what about this? What's going on here? I see a bridge in the distance, but it looks like there's a gate blocking it. Hmm, looks like there's another island on the other side of the bride. The bride? But it seems we can't cross it. <laughs> we gotta spit roast that bride. Yeah, that seems to be the case. We gotta, we gotta spit roast. <laughs> Go on now, <laughs> bro. <laughs> Where is, like... Oh my god, wait, what? okay. Yeah, I'm confused. Um, oh, I think the map turns, if anything. Yeah, well, there's somebody up in here. The glasses girl. Well, a glasses girl, I don't know. So I guess that was one of them that we couldn't go into, so I guess this bridge over here leads to that person? Um, oh, that one's locked too. You know what? I think I'm just gonna try and fast travel, because I'm oddly... Oh, no, I can't. Oh, fuck me. Okay. I guess I'll just... What's going on in this one, too? Uh, is this the same line of dialogue? Y yeah, it's because it says the sprite again, too. Okay. I guess I can only move sideways, so keep going sideways until something happens. I'm actually, like... Hold on. Can I, like... It said something about clicking sticks. Oh my god, these are all shut. Okay, okay, I'll just keep going sideways till something changes, I guess. Whee! Oh, oh, here we go. Jabberwock Park. Okay, that sounds nice. Sounds pleasant. Nothing bad ever associated with the Jabberwock. Ooh. Oh, shit. That is... Oh, I guess he does have glasses, doesn't he? Okay. So, this is a park. Hey, damn right it is. Park surrounded by the ocean. Hmm, feels so nice. Such a laid-back attitude. Damn right. But if we weren't in a situation like this, I'd probably be enjoying some lazy sunbathing myself. If. If. Being the keyword. <laughs> you really think, like, you'd just chill out and be like, oh yeah, like, this is cool. 
How are your introductions going? I'd like to inform you about uh, yet another feature you may have already noticed, but you have a level assigned to you. It's displayed on top right corner of screen. Your level increases by performing various actions such as walking, examining, and talking to others. Every time you level up, you'll become stronger than you were before. Number of skills you can equip will also increase, so please try your hardest to level up often. Okay. Oh, whoa. Oh, okay, that freaked me out for a moment. I don't even know why. What's going on with it? I want to see the Jabberwock. What's what's it all about? It's a bronze statue of various animals. Plus, it's pretty huge. God huge. damn. Whoa. What a... Whoa. I forgot. My, I was about to do the fucking Russian voice for him. What a grand statue. Yeah, it's grand. But it's, isn't it also kind of creepy? Is it? You think so? I think it looks splendid. I mean, look at it. It probably symbolizes the whole island. Does it? It sure is grand. This island symbol, huh? I would be kind of worried if it was like what symbolically represented the island. Okay, let's talk to Fat Boy. Let's see what's going on with him. Oh, what do you want? This guy's presence is overwhelming. He doesn't seem very approachable. <laughs> Even his body is overwhelming. This is calling him fat. This is mean. Ah, uh, Biakia. Thank you. Have time for a small introduction? Introduction? Come on, Hajime. Um, hello. Oh, wait, <laughs> that's yours. <laughs> no, that's my name. Um, hello, my name is Hajime Hinata. He's Hajime no Ippo. Uh, my name is Byakuya Ptolemy. I don't know how I became so fat. I am the ultimate affluent progeny. So, in the initial game, his whole thing was like, he was just the, um... He was just the richest kid. Like, yeah. he was the ultimate rich kid. Affluence. Like, okay. <laughs> yeah, like, it's like, why would he be accepted to a school for that? Like, he just paid money to get into school. That's all that he did. I'm done. That's it, right? Back off. I, I can tell this guy is thumbing his nose at me. Yes, I am with my thumb right now. I suppose that's Biakia for you. What do you mean? Uh, someone's fucking revving the truck outside. Oh, no, don't worry about it. <laughs> oh, wait, this is me. That's why. Okay, my bad. That guy's particularly special, even by ultimate standards. He's next in line to inherit his family's massive financial conglomerate. He's already begun managing the business operations, and his work is, like, was enormous. It's completely accurate to call him the ultimate affluent progeny. He's the epitome of exceptional, I guess, if he just throw money at everything. That's, like, a manga origin story. Is it? <laughs> Hey you there, Hajime no Ippo, was it? Eh? Tell me, why did Hook's Peak Academy choose you? What is your ultimate talent? Um, the thing is... Oh, I love the thing. He's my favorite of the Fantastic Four. How does he can't remember? Oh, down to bottom of pecking order with you. You don't remember. Oh, no. fuck, God damn it! I keep forgetting I'm this guy. Apparently he lost his memory due to shock. He can't really remember much. He's so fat. Oh, this... I really we finished talking. How much longer do you tend to stand there? Move along, there's only thing your skinny types are good at, it seems. Oh, let's just leave, Hajime. Yeah, sure thing. I'm the fattest one on this island. You bitches get away from me. <laughs> this build and the overwhelming aura of refinement just pushes people away. Is that what it means to be the ultimate affluent progeny? I... I... I don't know. I think the guy's just a dick. Okay, do we... Do we want to talk to Nagito again? Because, like, we've already chatted with him. Nah, I don't need to. Yeah, okay, let's see. I think from this point, I could probably fast travel back to... Yeah, I could go... God. So I guess it's just entirely cyclical. Like, I can just move in any direction and I'll get mm -hmm. wherever I need to get. So, yeah, okay, that's not so bad. I'll just do the attack on Titan Sprint. <laughs> oh, God! I hope I actually have to run from, um somebody at one point. Actually, wait, now that I think about it, this is probably where some people are. Or it's just an inner... No, yeah. What? Oh, wait, my back... Yeah, it's back where we started. Oh, god dang it. Okay, I'm sorry. Nagito Komaida. Back into running mode we go. Alright, so what do, you, what do you think of Danganronpa so far, Jason? Um, which is a lot of build-up. Yeah. We're still in the prologue. It... it 
it could be a bit before anything happens now yeah. but that's that's like how these fucking dating sim games go i say dating sim but like i said there is no dating this is an airport right so those things over there must be you'd think no one would no one thinks this hey, yay. what yay it's like a fucking kid couldn't we just use those planes to escape this island no. Yeah, it's impossible. If they are damaged, I can fix them, but it looks like these plans are just for show. Just for show? Yeah, it's just been completely removed. Nothing I can do about that. Completely removed? Stop repeating what I say. <laughs> what do you say? <laughs> Whatever, whoever brought us to this island must have also done that, right? The same person who's controlling the stuffed animal, who's Sami, but who is doing this? Yo, my Why did they bring us to this island in the first place? And how do they do it? The more I think about it, the less it makes sense. The less sense it makes. That's all the same. I like I've been misreading lines already from the get go, so I'm just like, whatever works. Oh yeah, that reminds me. You and me haven't been introduced yet, right? Name's K uh, Kazuichi Soda. I'm the ultimate mechanic. Nice to meet you. Call me Soda Boy. Yeah. Look at his face. Yeah. How does he get his teeth like that? As expected from someone who called the ultimate mechanic, Kazuichi is a savant when it comes to fixing machines. If he says it's impossible to fix this plane, it's truly beyond repair. Don't think twice about it. He could be a killer, I don't know. Yeah, even so, actually, remove the engine. Whoever's keeping us here must have planned this to a T. You think so too, huh? Doesn't that seem pretty strange to you? Uh, yeah, it's pretty strange, but I think it's an acceptable level of strange, you know? Huh? Yeah, like, if we escaped here, where would all the killing happen? Well, think about it. It's not like we're being forced to do something dangerous or anything. That was mentioned in the safety precautions for the school trip. Remember the school trip guidelines were in the e-handbook? Oh, I haven't read that. Oh, no, they're making us read it. Rule 1, extreme violence is prohibited. Please be peaceful, relaxing, be considerate, obtain hope fragments, don't litter. Uh, lead teacher cannot directly interfere with the students. Okay. Pretty, pretty simple rules. It looks like we're being kept safe, so why wouldn't this be like any other school trip? Nothing dangerous about this island. Spend these peaceful and relaxing days nourishing hope, just as, as Usami said earlier. It seems these rules are in place to help us do that. Are you saying you believe what that thing told us? She forced us to come here, you know? You know, everyone else is having a really cool time, and you're just being a little, you, you, you're being a little bitch, Hajime. Don't be such a pessimist. You should look at this situation with a bit more hope, you know? Optimism is essential for people to live satisfied lives. Eh, I guess it's okay if we just enjoy our vacation, see how this whole thing plays out, right? Yeah, if you stare closely at that strange looking bunny girl, she might actually start looking pretty fuckable. Yeah. <laughs> I'm actually jealous of how carefree he's being right now. Oh, I just want to fuck that rabbit. Ugh! Oh, <laughs> uh, we. Do we. Did we ever yeah, talk to? Him, th yeah. yeah, it's like who's this fucker? Uh oh, he's got a deep voice. Uh, do you want to be him? Um, sure. Hmm. Hmm. I think he's a weeb. Eh, like weeb. Um, <laughs> Clemente. <laughs> well, we already have Clemente. We do. That's right. Um. Okay. Be just like. Oh. Uh. Snap right there. Snap, snap oh. right there. Oh no, I accidentally hit the A button. Where's the transcript? I don't know what you just said. There it is. Snap right there. If you value your lives, you're not coming any closer. And now, how do we get out of this? Okay, there we go. Hmm. And say, stay back. Or oh, very well, I should extend that carriage of yours. <laughs> What's this guy talking about? Hey, hey, hey. Would you like to know my name? Others may see your courage as recklessness. However, I welcome it. I hate this character already. In honor of your courage, I shall reveal to you my name. May you never forget it as long as you live. <laughs> you may call me Gundam Tanaka. Remember it well, for it is the name that will one day rule this world. Uh, did you ever know anybody in middle school or high school that acted like this? No. <laughs> I wish I had. Just to be like, I, I saw- oh, really? oh no! Oh no! This guy's bad news! It's like fucking ultimate oh, child guy. groomer. It's like, a what? He's kidding, right? He's actually serious. That's pretty out there. Just like his fucking talent. Now then, it's my turn to ask questions. Whose master are you? What? 
<laughs> he is a breeder. He's a yeah. questions breeders ask. Which tribe did you make your pact with? Answer me. <laughs> uh, what do you mean pact? And what do you mean by tribe? Answer me now, though I shall cast you into a watery grave once you do. What wolf fandom are you a part of? <laughs> then it's best if I don't answer. I think he's asking if you used to have a pet. How did I assume that? I have no idea. Pet? No, the only animal I've taken care of was a hermit crab. We passed around the elementary school. We passed it around. <laughs> yeah, Gundam is just like, ah, pass it around. My, you're my type of guy. So, a mere insect. Ha! Your magic essence caps on a lowly five. Trash. God, what a prick. Yeah, really? Mm. It's wrong to call trash trash. Trash like you should not dare to speak one as grand as me. <laughs> oh, I love them. Who do you think I am? I am the great and powerful Gun Tanaka, supreme overlord of ice. But there's those are hamsters. Hold on a minute. Something strange just came out of your scarf. Taming evil by using myself as a bed. <laughs> what? Truly, this is the secret art of the Tanaka Empire. Wait, so is he that part of the breeding? <laughs> He's the bed? It's like something oh. you see on a nature's show. I guess he fits the bill of ultimate breeder. He's that part of the nature show. One of my far four dark devas of destruction, Mirage Golden Hawk, Jump P, has this to say. We're not used to going easy on our enemies, so don't make us angry. You wouldn't like us when we're angry. <laughs> <laughs> this guy's such a nerd. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Uh, yeah, I know he seems a little odd, but apparently he did splendidly as a member of the breeding club. Ugh. I've heard he can tame any animal and even manage to succeed at uh, proliferating an endangered species. Oh, that poor dodo. Rumor has it he can speak to animals. Well, it's probably just a joke. Speak with animals? Well, he starts to be eccentric enough in that regard. I mean, there's no way a normal person would attempt to raise hamsters inside their own scarf. Uh, yeah, with their own body as the breeding ground. Okay, well, glad. Oh, oh look at yeah. that pineapple go. <laughs> okay, I wonder. Uh, just be looking out the window. Okay, we'll leave this area. Uh, and I wonder. Fuck, I wish I could, like... The way the other Gun Rampa games worked was, like, it was... Or at least the first one, I guess. It's, like, it's first person, so you actually, like, know where you're heading to. This <laughs> one, I, like... On the map, where is this? Like, I don't know which one... I guess it's the... Wait, hold on. Where's the airport? Okay, so... Oh, it could be Rock and Roll Girl. Or... I don't know. I'm just confused. Let's give it a look-see. We the Rocket Punch Market. It's... I don't know, that's the name. Uh, okay, so it's these ones. So this is the supermarket. It's pretty big. Look at those big-ass cola cans. <laughs> oh, fucking... I honestly, amazingly, didn't actually notice those. <laughs> Them boys, thick. If we're on a tropical island, does that mean we're in international waters? That means anything can happen. Anything. Oh, fucking damn, why do I keep forgetting I'm this guy? Thanks to this place, we don't need to worry about food and any other necessities for a while now. Except for water. All we got is super thick cola. It'll make you thick. For a while. It's just a figure of speech. But there's no guarantee anything here is edible. What if all this stuff is... Oh, wait, that was your voice. Never mind. <laughs> What if all the stuff is poison? Thank you for reading my thoughts. <laughs> yeah, I am a mind reader. You certainly are the skeptical type. Of course I am. Even the supermarket is strange. Yeah, yo, mama's strange. What? <laughs> Look around, we're the giant supermarket and there's nobody else here except us, except for yo mama. Yo mama! Well, <laughs> she's a, she's a thick ass cola. Oh, damn. <laughs> oh, well that can't be helped. Didn't Usami say this island is uninhabited? That's exactly my point. Eh. Eh. Well, what happened? I got a something in my pocket. <laughs> it's nothing. <laughs> what is, it's a smoker, but it's just that face. You gotta, you gotta swig for me. <laughs> just like I'm imagining vapor clouds erupting from her mouth. She's 
Tara got me funny. Damn right she is. Don't look at her. <laughs> um, you know. Oh. <laughs> oh, don't mind. Don't mind her. She's just having a bad trip. <laughs> Why is she crying? Bullying a girl. Not cool, Hajime. What the fuck? <laughs> I didn't do anything. At least I think that's a girl. Ah, oh, so your name is Hajime. If it's okay with you, may I please remember your name? <laughs> of course, I don't mind you remembering, but... My name is Mikatsumiki. I'm from the bottom of my heart, because it's, there's not a lot of it left. I think we can get along. It's all blackened with tar. Oh, ultimate nurse. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> the ultimate nurse because she get fucking smoked too many cigarettes. I know what not to do. is drawing a black from nervousness. I need to cigarette the focus. <laughs> and I went through all that trouble preparing 5,000 different topics to discuss after introduction. <laughs> They're all about smoking. That seems excessive. It's okay if you take your time and remember slowly. We'll wait as long as it takes. You want a cigarette? Come on now. Dance for it. 